Picture 1960s newspaper clippings and teeth hanging on a string like a book of life. And me in the kitchen with my would-be killer, picking their canines out of a mouth harp, cigaretting a pen, calling black fire to prayer. I reckon I need to raise my voice. Maybe it's hard to be heard from down here in the holler, where the sunshine can't sink in until way up past dawn. All I can do is climb to the top of what's left of an ancient mountain, stripped down to the barest bones. Mexican protesters line the port wearing red caps that read, Make Tijuana Great Again. An ode to American racism and a revelation of their own. They shout, Go back to your country. There is nothing left for you here. School buildings turn gutted carcasses. Internal organs emptied for market to be sold to lowest bidder, then repackaged, stuffed with implants from foreign bodies. Our children walked into hungry mouths. Because we lit, because we have always been lit, because we are the utility company, have always been of value, have always been of service, have always had a function, have always been a source, have always been an oil, have always been a lamp. In my city, my mentees would rather catch the bus all their life than get a license. I guess they know they're just as likely to die from getting pulled over as they are from gun violence, and y'all wonder why the riots. Wonder why we hate when the cops come around. No common ground, only face the concrete, calling the police. It's like attempted murder in these streets. Fighting words to say the least. And a Karen will get her ass kicked for playing pretend. Cause they are racing my kin while I'm raising my kin. It's like it's a game and we seem to be the wrong race to win.